Hey everyone, welcome to my channel, See Val Wander. I'm Val, and I wanted to share some tips with you today on how I keep my pups Jubilee and Paddington comfortable when they have to travel with me in the car on a really hot day. So first things first, I check the temperature and it's 96 outside. So inside the car, it's about 130 degrees. This chart gives you a good idea what the outside temperature, what it converts to inside temperature of your car after it's been closed up for 10 to 30 minutes, and it is in Fahrenheit. Okay, so now let's test the ground and see if it's too hot for the dogs to walk on the asphalt or the concrete. If you can't comfortably walk on it in your bare feet, your pups or your pets can't either. Ah! Ah! <sighs> if you can walk comfortably or stand for a long time in your bare feet, you're good. Start your engine and get that AC going to cool it down. Okay, so now let's get the car seats ready. So you can see that I have a seat belt harness system for them. They, they do have harnesses that they wear as well. But we're going to add cooling blankets to their car seats. And just kind of tuck them around there, make sure that they're comfortable. And then I'm gonna add some ice blocks. These I got free that just came with some medication that was shipped. So I just reuse them until they wear out, but you can also buy them. I've seen them on Amazon and at this time of the year, usually in your camping section for coolers. Okay, now I'm gonna shut the door, let that AC do its job and go in and get the dogs harnessed and bring them out. Oh, Miss Jubilee, are you CP? Paddington. What? I wasn't doing nothing. You sweet boy. All right, so I've got some cold water here to put in so that if they need a drink, we are set. Just gonna make sure everybody's harnessed. Get Paddington over into his seat. He likes to share with his sister. Are you back in your sister's section? <laughs> Having to. You gonna get over in your bed? Huh? How you doing, sissy? Are you doing okay back there? Alright. You're doing good. Another way to help cool the car down is I actually take it to the car wash. I don't know why, well, probably because it's cold water, but it seems to not only cool down the car, but um, I don't know, just driving in a clean car always seems to feel better anyway. It's funny how these two don't seem to mind the car wash at all. Years ago, I had a Great Dane, and he unfortunately would freak out during a car wash and would climb up into my lap while I was trying to drive a stick. It was always really interesting. Okay, so we are now on our way to Del Taco to pick up some lunch. And what I did was I placed a mobile order through their app. This will reduce the wait time and I'm gonna use the drive-through so I don't need to leave the dogs unattended. Since the pandemic, there are so many options now where you don't even have to get out of your car and I use them when I need to like this. Also like to use curbside pickup, which is great. So we were only gone for about 25 minutes. We're back home and they are still pretty comfortable and it's still around 96 degrees outside. Thanks for watching. If you have already subscribed to my channel, 
thank you. I really appreciate it. If you would like to join my merry band of wanderers, just click the subscriber button. It's free and it really helps my channel. And if you like this vlog, please give it a thumbs up. Also, drop a comment if you have used any of these tips yourself. And I hope to see you next time.